Hey everyone, Jonathan Allen here from Camp and RV in Stratford, Ontario. Uh, we got another brand new arrival here for a walkthrough video. It is a 2022 Puma 27 RLSS. Uh, this is 31 and a half feet overall tip to tail exterior length. Weighs 6,610 pounds dry weight. Uh, and it's a rear living room, front clean bedroom. We're gonna give you a nice walk around. We'll check out all the features on the outside. We'll check out the interior layout as well. Uh, so starting at the front, we've got our Diamond plate at the front prevents stone chips when you're traveling. We've got our propane tanks on the front with the hard plastic cover. Our stabilizers all the way around. So at each corner, you just hit a button and the, the jacks go down. You don't have to crank them. Uh, we do have a pass-through storage compartment at the front. You can get out of, get at it from both sides. Larger door on this side, so loading all of your larger items. Uh, and then uh, we do have two doors on this one too, which is nice. So you get one that goes into the bedroom. There's one into the main living area at the back. Uh, now also on the front here we do have the solar on the side so it is pre-wired for a portable panel uh, so if you are camping without a hydro hookup you can plug a panel in and it'll keep your battery charged while you're while you're camping uh, so now as i mentioned power stabilizer jacks on all four corners like i said we got two doors so we do have our regular uh stairs into the the front door which is not your main entry main entry is at the back here and we do have the upgraded step above stairs so these fold right into the door frame and they're nice and solid because they do sit on the ground uh, we do have a tankless water heater which we did order on this model so it's an on-demand hot water system uh, we've got an outside shower over here we've got a black tank flusher so after you've emptied out your sewer tank you can hook a hose on there and it cleans out the inside of the black tank we've got outdoor speakers which have lights built into them and we also have a power awning which covers both doors and it has led lights built into it as well uh, also over here we've got power outlets uh, you got your fresh water holding tank fill valve over here uh, we've also got an entry assist handle beside the door so when you're walking in and out you have something to grab onto uh, at the back here we do have a roof ladder for getting up on the roof to, to clean or service you've got our spare tire on the back which is included you've got uh, the power connection back here which the power cord is included and they are pre-wired for a backup camera as well cable and satellite hookups are on the back here and then we do have our power slide out on the off door side uh, so it gives you a lot of extra floor space in the living room which we're going to check from the inside here uh, there is access to storage this is underneath the dinette inside now I, I don't have this open but you can access that from inside or outside sewer connection we do have over here so it's got the black and gray water valves We've got our city water hookup over here. And again, this is that storage that goes right through from one side to the other at the front. Uh, but come on in, we'll walk inside and take a look at everything inside. Nice feature, you do get a screen door which separates from your main door. So, and then it's a rear living room layout. So at the back, we do have our two chairs, uh, which do recline out. Uh, then we've also got uh, overhead cabinets for storage above. You can see lots of windows and they do have the pull down shades. They're a slow rise shade system, so they will ride right up. Uh, and then we do have a nice little tabletop in between the two chairs. There's a power outlet there. Uh, uh, down here is our power converter, so breakers and fuses. Uh, our kitchen area. So first of all, we have our control panel when you walk in the door here. You've got your awning control, your slide control, all your lights, your water heater, and all the tank monitors. And then also the tankless water heater, we have the uh, control panel for that here. Uh, with the kitchen area, you get a fair amount of counter space. You do got the nice big stainless steel sink. It comes with the cutting board uh, sink cover, as well as the roll-up sink cover. Uh, so you got lots of extra counter space when you're not using the sink. And then you do have a uh, pull-down sprayer uh, and a movable faucet head. Good amount of storage down below. You do get your drawers as well as cabinetry. Cabinetry up above as well. Uh, we've got a three burner stove with a flush mount glass cover. And then we do have the oven built in down below. Microwave built in up above. Uh, it is an 11 cubic foot 12 volt fridge. So a nice feature about these fridges is they're very energy efficient. They run off your battery even when you're not plugged into power. Uh, they're easy to service and a lot less expensive to service if you do run into issues down the road. We do have pantry storage over here. So again, quite a bit of storage in this model. Uh, you got your entertainment center here with the wall mounted TV and that TV will pull out an angle. So if you want to give yourself a better viewing angle, you can. 
Uh, we've got some storage down below as well as a stereo, which is AM, FM, and Bluetooth. So, and then you've got your uh, sound bar here as well as the outdoor speakers. Uh, now, across from the kitchen, we do have our sofa, which will jackknife down into a bed. You do get cup holders built in with an armrest, uh, and there is built in storage down below. Uh, the dinette will drop down into a bed as well. You've got storage underneath both dinette seats. And they give you these little baskets you can pull out to fill up. And then again, this had the access to the storage from the outside as well. And again, lots of windows all with those pull down shades. We do have the bathroom. So you do get, do get a corner shower with the sliding doors. There's a shower surround and a skylight up above. You do get a vanity with medicine cabinet and storage. And then we do have the foot flush toilet over here. Spot to hang uh, towels up above. And then you do get a built-in roof vent with a 12 volt fan. And then we do have the bedroom up at the front. So it's a queen walk around bed. Uh, as I mentioned, you do get the separate entrance from outside. So it gives you lots of airflow. There's a window on the other side so you can have airflow going right through. You get wardrobe cabinets on both sides. You get overhead cabinets up above. Uh, you do get power outlets on both sides. There's USB plugs on the one side. Nice little uh, bedside tables. Uh, this bed does lift up for some storage underneath as well. That's our box for the TV in there. And then this one does have a roof end in the bedroom as well as it is pre-wired for a bit, uh, TV in the bedroom. So you can mount the TV on the wall here and then you got power and cable hookups up there. Uh, the AC is ducted through the ceiling, and then the heat on this model is vented through the floor. It's all LED lighting throughout. Uh, so again, this is the 2022 Puma 27 RLSS. We have it in stock currently at Camp and RV in Stratford. Uh, give us a call today to book your appointment. Happy camping.